Hi, I'm Kelly Morrison, and I'm really nervous right now because we are filming on the roof of my house in Ottawa, and I don't like heights. So this is Ottawa, out here. I'm not originally from here. I grew up in Saskatoon, Saskatchewan. As a child, I was really into drawing, and I had a great imagination, so I decided that I wanted to make cartoons for a living. So after high school, I enrolled in Red House College of Animation, and I took classical animation. Uh, after that, I worked as a stop-motion animator on the show Wapos Bay, and then I moved here to Ottawa to take script writing. When you're in your early 20s, you do tend to move around a lot, and you're searching for your place in life and where you fit in, and that has a lot to do with my film that I made, which is called Beatless Nick. He's a little beatnik, he's unhip, he's kind of a square, and he's really looking for his place in life. So the idea I had for my film came from this drawing I made of this tiny little beatnik who I called Beatless Nick. And I decided this little guy had no sense of rhythm. Since I was setting the film back in the 1950s, I thought it would be a great idea to adopt the style of the 1950s for the cartoon. I was really inspired by the UPA films of the time. The music had to be jazz. The last song is done by my friend's band, Red Orange, and the rest was composed by Michelle Webb. For the voice talent, I use friends, family, family of friends, and friends of family. Uh, the beat poet girl is my sister, Heather Morrison, who actually loathes the design of the character because she has a huge butt. The film took me two and a half years to make. It was all hand-drawn, then scanned into the computer and colored. I'm Kelly Morrison. Don't be a square. Check out Beatless Nick on CBC Exposure.